I'm sort of a big deal in American public life and in intellectual life, media life. You, you are the only person I've ever co-hosted anything with. Let's say it was the only thing you did. Uh, the uh, Most 24-year-olds are not having a weekly podcast with a national figure. Okay, so is Dennis Prager a big deal in American intellectual life? That's absurd. All right, you use Google Scholar, and there's virtually no academic interest in the intellectual thought of Dennis Prager. There's, there's none. All right, there, there's as much interest in the intellectual thought of Dennis Prager as there is in the intellectual thought of, of Luke Ford. So is, is Dennis Prager a big deal? Yeah, in certain segments of America, Dennis Prager is a big deal. To hundreds of millions of Americans, Dennis Prager doesn't register at all. But to several hundred thousand Americans, Dennis Prager is a big deal, right? To less than 1% of the American population, or possibly 1% of the American population, Dennis Prager is a big deal. To 99% of the American population, Dennis Prager is not a big deal, right? To several dozen people, I'm a big deal. To 99.99% percent of America, I'm not a big deal. The alt-right as a kind of aesthetic and vibe and its talking points and its commitments even has largely won. That's absolutely absurd. That bears absolutely no relationship to reality. The only way that this outburst makes sense, you, you recognize that it's a way that uh, Richard exaggerates and lives in a fantasy world of his own importance.